Hello and welcome back to another episode of Phoenix Point. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our legendary blind playthrough. We have landed this time with a squad size increase of plus one. Grell has joined us as a berserker. Let's see what that class can do. I'm quite skeptical <coughs> about uh, melee classes. Unless they are called Templars, in which case they are awesome and completely imbalanced. Anyways, we need to kill all of the thieves or enemies here. Not 100% sure yet how many we're going to Let's face, see. but we're going to fa uh, find that out real quick. I like the jetpack. Unfortunately, we can't fire afterwards. And can't really hunker Receiving. down. Let's position here for now. Anything that moves. Good old Overwatch. Down. Let's go. Rail moves right into the house. And on the other side, moving a bit closer. Uh, is there any good area where I could see the Never will points? Maybe I'm missing that currently. Is this the number of will points? Was it initiative? Hmm. Oh, we can just hover over them. Will points seven, okay. Will points one out of seven. Five, nine, seven. Okay, cool. Good. Understood. Understood. Overwatch. And Overwatch. Boy, quite a few enemies. Oh boy, quite a few enemies. We are out gunned. Aiming. Yeah, Shattered Realm deals a lot of damage. I like it. Good, next up. Let's blast them. We can still overwatch with zero uh, AP with a sidearm. I like that. Moving out. Preparing to fire. I'd like to focus fire, really. Oh! 
slightly going back so that we have less enemies that can see us. Really good hit. Here comes the Phoenix. Shadow Realm goes back, just out of line of sight. Realm moves over. Here I come. And even closer. Next turn, we are near the enemy. Good, let's see what they are doing. This thief is heavily injured. Misses. But only has one AP to shoot with his pistol, so they can shoot a lot. That would have been a great hit. You're gonna get it now. <clears throat> Speaking about great hits, this guy is just laying the fire down on us. Can't wait. Come on, you're kidding me. That's unfortunate. Ready, sort of. On the move. Still full cover. Identifying target. Holding position. down oh. few more shots Jarenks then goes into cover operative on the move good we're now in melee ah. <laughs> I need help here I don't think we have attacks of opportunity or anything, but he's bleeding for 60, like, oh, that looks quite serious. So melee is really good once you're in melee. And then you're being the punching back of everyone else. Uh, not good. Not good at all. Doing it.
Okay. Ooh. Take too long to get uh, to get up I'm there. Switching out. Moves over. They disabled the arm. Target detected. Let's go. Aiming. Good. I think it was an okay turn. <laughs> it's still quite strange to have all of these like one AP left over. So he hit the the equipment. Set equipment damaged. I'm here. I'm repositioning. I'm repositioning. Oh. What? Resisted? Going in. All right, see you later. Shoot? No. Well, it takes too much uh, time. How much ammunition do we have? I'm confused about... Oh, 42 out of 60. Yeah, I just need to see where we need to look. at maximum will points well pretty sure there is still someone shooting from over here holding position not exactly sure how I could reach them let's do this <laughs> ok, 
Okay, that signals that something's on the floor. Oh, stupid magazine. Going in. Oh, there is yet another enemy. Okay, cool. Uh, we have no will points left over. My head. I can't breathe. Plus four will points. I like it. No time to lose. The guy was overwatching. Enemy spotted. Let's see now. Okay, so... Moving into half cover. On the move. Moving back into full cover. Keep my eyes open. Here we go. Okay, he looks into a completely different direction. Moving out. Preparing to fire. Free aim. Ah! Is that interrupting his stupid headshot? Uh, his stupid Overwatch. Let's go. It's not. Taking aim. Ah! Wow, that was quite intense. And the enemies can shoot back. <clears throat> it's not as trivial anymore. And I still am missing kind of that intuitive feeling of when are we exposed? How do we deal with uh, multiple enemies on a certain side? Hi there. My name is Athena. And I'd like to thank you on behalf of Synedrion as a whole. You know... Outsiders sometimes think of Synedrion as a bunch of naive, helpless people living in a big bubble. And I know we can appear that way. But the truth is, we are more like a powder keg. Trying to build a truly democratic society without hierarchies involves a lot of arguing. The terraformers want one thing, the polyphonic tendency another. Zara clashes with Nikolai, Stas tries to keep everyone calm, Every haven has a totally different set of priorities. And then something like this happens. Yep. I'm being honest about our flaws, because I think, crazily enough, the whole thing works. We've built something remarkable, given everything we've been through, and the Phoenix Project could help us really make a difference on this wretched planet. 
Think about it, please. We have a lot in common, and here's your payment. We believe in people being rewarded for their labor. So we can increase our favor with them or take a payment. Um, uh, that was, they, well, they were the ones that I found least exciting out of the three. I'll take the payment. You're welcome. I hope we can work together again. Okay, so personal, couple of things. Cheddar Realm does have some minor upgrades. Uh, I wish we would have more points for him. And by points, I mean more movement. He's doing so well with the gun, unfortunately. just doesn't seem uh, to work without having something that you can do with a two uh, with a two action mm. can't he just have a normal grenade are you telling me that Well, he can. Fantastic. That's good. Cool. Then we have Ian the Butcher Owens. With return fire, shoots back at an enemy when attacks uh, when attacked. Provided the soldier uses direct line of fire, projectile weapons, and the enemy is within half perception range. That sounds like a no-brainer. Ten points left over. I like willpower, that's an important step, but I also like to survive. Um, then we have Jeranks. Return fire, or do we get that additional perception, which I think Sounds almost better. Very expensive, so can't get strength up, really, but additional to plus two to willpower effectively means it's worth worth uh, 16 skill points at this point. And 10 perception range, I assume, means he can shoot better and more accurately. The game, by the way, is even tracking current magazines. Wow. Dilly G. So far, good, but a bit inaccurate. I like the whole sidearm uh, steel. That is great. Damage 50, effective range 27 versus... Oh, so that's a longer ranged weapon. I see how it is. Like it. Good. Bit heavier, but overall good. Um, help me understand. Can Shattered Realm take a normal small gun? No. That's just not his style. He's just dropping the heavy, hard guns. Oh, finally we got we got some stuff. We got some side arms going. I like it. Good. Because now we can at least do something on range. I uh, would like to upgrade hit points with Grell. Oh, 
Okay, so far so good. Seems legit. We have more research available. Oh, we can't really use that weapon before it's reverse engineered. Okay. Well, in that case... Can you just reload your gun here? It's empty, I see. No more ammunition. Good. We need to get back to the base. No point in keeping the guys just on the ship. Some weapons are not full load. Yeah, no shit, I can see that. Can you just reload? Is there an option to fully reload? Thank you, okay, so... Apparently buying ammunition works. Oh, I see how it is. These guns here. We don't have we don't have these magazines. ARL magazines and we need to manufacture them. Equipment. Okay, it means we need to find these. Okay. I would like to get a vehicle as well. That sounds like fun. Okay, we need to wait until everybody is filled up again, so let's do that. Almost. Research complete. The disciples of Anu were a mystery. Where others saw devastation, they saw hope, where others saw the end of the world. They saw a new beginning. Their leader called herself the Exalted, and she claimed to believe in humanity. She preached that the human soul was perfect, that the root of our problems was our insufficient evolution. The Pandora virus was a threat, but it was also an opportunity to change ourselves, to become better humans, to mutate, we knew that humanity needed to adapt. There was no other way to survive. The disciples offered a solution, but what was their end game? There was something beyond their hierarchies and their rituals. The exalted had a secret. Not sure if I like uh, the faction now that I've gotten to know a bit more about them. So we could get that pistol, the Ephaestus, um, researched. We could get Synhydron. The trading 
does seem to make sense as well. Human population monitoring available. I don't know what that means, but that sounds like a decent bonus as well. Let's get to know that extra faction for now. Weapon research is good and we should do that. But an extra faction might be a good idea as well. So in terms of personal, everybody looks ready, although we don't have the ability to, to fully reload all weapons. Recruit available. Moving there. And by the way, recruits available in two days. Well, I tell you what, we have one available right here. We've got a new soldier. Let me um, make it one of ours. I need a new subscriber. Good, much better. Euler just joined our team. Hello and welcome, Euler. Lovely to have you on board. Another assault. Uh, we need to manufacture some stuff for him. Uh, running out of great options here. Euler gets a med kit. And a grenade. Good enough. Some more ammunition. Sounds about right. We haven't found any mounts or equipment upgrade. He has sniper wrist, gained sniper rifle proficiency. Hmm, nice. So he could have both weapons, I suppose. Quarterback, 25% grenade range and two speed. Okay. It's not bad, I like the extra abilities, although I haven't really seen all of them. Cool, so it appears to me that our team is ready to move out. Let's explore. Our operatives are disturbed to report the discovery of what they describe as a pig pipeline. A bizarre growth resemblance of a stitched together bodies of pigs, several miles long. It is unclear uh, what the end, uh, what end the Pandera vi virus created this organi uh, organism or why it recombined pig DNA to achieve its purpose. Perhaps the entire thing is an aberration. Burn it. Hmm. Investigate it. Hmm. Investigate it. At some point it disappears into the ground. Reading suggests it might continue for several more miles in this fashion. Our operatives attach a number of sensors, take several samples. Perhaps some of the data thus collected will prove useful in our research. 125 research. Great. So, what is up here? An exploration site. Well, that's that's the storyline mission, right? Okay, let's do these two first, and then we'll get the storyline mission complete. Sinedrian was built on a dream, a world without hierarchies, without leaders, where human beings could embrace the potential of technology without its destructive side effects. 
the radicals of the old world had been proven right. The status quo could not sustain itself. But what now? What was the next step? Some argued for coexistence with the Pandoran ecosystem, hoping for a peaceful solution. Others advocated putting humanity before nature and claiming the planet for themselves. Trusting in the safety of their havens, the people of Sanhedrin argued about the best way forward, but the Pandora virus had little interest in their arguments, and its power was still growing. Okay, cool. So, that gave us more research, more tech. I want that human population monitoring. I don't know what it is, but it sounds like it is useful. Continuing to explore. No hostile forces have been detected, but there is probably some resource that we can find here. And sure, there is 600 materials. That is fantastic. And 100 food. Oh, yes. Thank you. Still no recruits. That will need to wait a bit longer. I'm not sure if we're doing good or if we're doing like absolutely poorly. One more med kit. Yes, please. And I wanted a vehicle. We're okay with armor. I would love to get <clears throat> that handgun as well. And two magazines. And that already concludes all of our resources, more or less. Fort Heinlein is a haven run by New Jericho, which means that uh, normal things are quite and under control, but right now there is an emergency. A group of soldiers is on a killing spree. It began with strange dreams, voices heard in the night. A local doctor tells our operatives, I could not detect any physical changes, but there were certainly no signs of infection. Their behavior, however, simply cannot be explained by PTSD or similar conditions, which we at New Jericho are sadly quite familiar with. It's like something has driven them mad. If we stop these soldiers now, New Jericho will undoubtedly be grateful with us, and thus starts a new mission and ends the current one. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you are a big fan of New Jericho, uh, let's give it an orderly thumbs up for this mission uh, and see you in the next episode. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.